It's an Adam adventure. It's an Adam adventure. It's the Adam adventure. Let's go. It is currently 6:30 in the morning, and I'm about to head off to Seattle. So, first leg of the trip underway. Cycling has always been a fun pastime of mine. I've certainly used it as a reliable form of transportation in my younger years, but I've never before biked 70 miles in one day with 45 pounds in pannier bag weight and 25 pounds in backpack weight. Though I trained for this, I was ill-prepared, and I took my rests where I could get them. Nevertheless, the landscapes I crossed in Oregon and Washington were serene. It was a tough first day, and I pushed hard across rivers and borders, oftentimes having to walk my bike up hills because my feet couldn't pedal anymore. And I fell a few times. And at one moment, I questioned why I was even doing this. But the view made the adventure all worth it. And even when I was walking because I was too tired to ride, I loved it. I loved every minute of it. Well, I did it. I made it to the campsite. I'm gonna be staying out all night. After a hard 70 miles, I'm finally here. If you're gonna do 70 miles a day on bike, Definitely train more than 20 miles a day. I wasn't ready for that. But I'm here, so time to set up camp and start cooking. Growing up, my family did our fair share of camping. And though I was never a Boy Scout, I did learn a thing or two about living in the great outdoors. That included building a fire, which I used to cook my freeze-dried food every night. All right guys, it's 10 o'clock at night and I just finished getting the fire going and the water boiling. So I've got mac and cheese here, Thai curry here, letting them sit in their bags for about 10, 15 minutes. And then I'm gonna give them an eat. Yeah. After a delicious filling meal, I turned in around 11. I had made it a third of the way to Seattle and though I was sore, I was ready for more. Good night. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like these videos and want to see more, feel free to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss a future episode. And also check out the video for the Life Straw, the water bottle I was using on this trip that filters out 99.9% .9 of all bacteria, available now at vat19.com.